Happy Father's Day, everybody. Happy Sunday. I was not planning on streaming today, but... Someone mentioned this game this weekend. And I saw Shroud playing it, so I'm like, hmm. I want to write an article about this game. So we have to play it. I'm talking about the game I'm hoping is better than PUBG. Cuisine Royale. Alright, so this game is in early access. Turn the music off. This game's in free early access right now. It's free for about 10 days or so. Uh, and then they're going to start charging for it to cover their server costs. So, but if you go to Steam and download Cuisine Royale right now and wait until you see me play it before you do that to see if it's worth your while, but maybe you should do it anyways because if you do it now, it'll stay free for you throughout the early access period. You won't have to pay for it. Uh, this thing launched Friday and there's been an update yesterday, an update today. And I think it launches uh, in full, real early access uh, on the 25th. So uh, from the 25th onward, you're going to have to pay to play this early access game. Stacy's in the house. Hey, Stacy. Happy Father's Day to your family. Um, let's try it out. Stacy, I'm sure you've seen uh, Megan and, and friends play a lot of Player Unknown's Battlegrounds, or PUBG, as they say. This seems to be another version of that. A little more kitchen themed. Find game US. Voice chat? Mic on? Let's see if it works. Hey, Megan's there. I guess you have a couple days off, off of work. Well, Megan and Stacy, we're going to find this out together. Because I, I don't really know what this is. Restricting area starts in... Oh, we're already in it. 25 alive. That's the map. No details on the map. I have a knife. I have really cool... Boxers. <laughs> Look at the back. Fuck, what is this? My arm. I got a pot on my head, a pan on my back, with some some big ass spoons hanging off the bottom. I see a weapon now. Oh, I'm still in the, I'm still in the uh, circle. So this Megan is free. Cuisine Royale is free on Steam. If you download it now in early access before. What? Well, that fucking hurts every time I do it. Oh! That was loud. Hmm. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> look, look at these character designs. He's got... Like strainers as shoulder pads. I like it. He's got a, he's got a waffle iron as like a butt protection. Dinosaur boxers, cherry boxers. You got pan in the front. <laughs> uh. Looks really good. I mean, yeah. Quick, it looks better than the loot box simulator. I mean, PUBG. It's super sketch. It, this was made as an April Fool's joke, but people kind of loved it. So they decided to release it as a real game. So this thing released Friday. And again, check it out. Just go to, uh, Megan, you should do it. Because if you want to get it for free, you should just add it to Steam right now. It's like five, five gig download. But if you get it, if you install it anytime between now and the 25th, you get to keep this game for free during early access. So you always start off with a knife. We've yet to see an actual gun yet, though.
Yeah, it does look actually not bad, right? Lighting. It's it's a lot more dense. Like there's actually shrubbery. Like this looks better than what PUBG does, right? And the walls as well. It's the animations are super janky though. But hey, it's free. I'm like a loot box simulator. I mean PUBG. So I don't understand why I keep finding mods for weapons, but no actual mo uh, weapons, you know. Oh, here we go. Auto. Oh wow, you can lean and everything? Cool. These weapons are old school, so maybe it's like uh, World War II era? <laughs> what is this? Here we go. Bunny slippers of bounce. Man, that... the sound effects that come with those warnings are pretty intense. Look, this looks very pretty. Totally is World War II. Oh, see, I, I walked right through the car. Let's test this out. That's awesome. Yeah, it's a little delayed on the opening of doors. What I got? Got one! Ooh. <laughs> the fucking helmet is awesome. Also the handbags. Where am I going here? I want to go to the center. You got the animations in there for... Yeah, it's very pretty. Oh, you can crouch? This is already better than PUBG, for reals. I don't know. I didn't see any squad options. I'll check when I get back to the menu. I'm sure I'll die. What? Oh, okay. So if you hold, if you tap, okay, so control is crouch, not C, you're holding it down, no, Z is prone, so that's the same, you move very slowly when you're crouched, you're not like running and crouching, um, if you hold down right click, you go to this mode, if you tap right click, you go to that, so you have to hold it to get to the scope. And obviously the player counts are not as high. Oh, this shit actually moves with you though. That's cool. I'm impressed. Let's go. Interactive map mode. Let's go. I can't... 
You can't do anything with the map. If you hold it down, you're supposed to be able to click on it, I guess. All you can do is look around. Movieverse, what's going on? This is the game that's replacing PUBG. You ready for this, Movieverse? Watch me jump. Woo! 360. And yeah, I have a handbag, and yes, I am wearing a pot as a helmet. Are you jealous? You should be. I just want to, I just want to try the sniper rifle, you know? Let's look at your stamina bar in the bottom right. Look, there's a whole like, city over there. It's, it appears to be World War II themed. Who wants some? Delicious pizza. It's not just pizza. It's delicious. World War II pizza. It's also not delivery. It's delicious. Uh, holding alt does not let you look around. Like in PUBG. Where is everybody? These were players. Red zone. Let's see what swimming is like. Is that a person? No. Swimming looks good. The lighting in the forest looks good. It actually makes you feel like it's darker, like you're in, in the shade. Yeah. We have finally some gunfire. Leaning works pretty well. Uh, the leaning seems like a little more serious, you know? Whoa. Movieverse says he's my best friend. Yeah, you're, you're all my best friends, Movieverse. <laughs> Stacy, I never actually met Movieverse. But you're all definitely my best friends. And I don't think I've known you that long. Ooh, we're at the border here. So, if there is gunfire over here, they're going to have to come to me. Right? I'm watching the border. we will see at least one survivor from this brawl.
Do you hear that? I thought I heard movement. Maybe it's just a spoon hanging off my helmet. Look at the energy shield in the sky. The effect. <sighs> Very strange. Yeah, uh, Megan, if you're still there, this game definitely... Uh, I don't... I have a feeling it doesn't support squads yet. And the player counts are just so low. so loud. Someone's... Someone's in here. How'd he get behind me without me hearing? I told you I thought I heard something in the bushes. Because safety first, movie verse. I'm just gonna wait. He could still be in there just chilling out. I'm trying to move not too fast in case it makes noise. That makes noise too. Hopefully they got the sound, directional sound figured out in this game, otherwise I'm in trouble. 100 sit-ups and 100 squats per day. That's, that's an awesome move for us. Keep it up. I, I should probably get on that myself. What is this? At least this dude has pretty good posture. Pads of speed? That's a Beretta. Where's that gun? Am I losing my mind here? Or... Oh, it switched it to here. There we go. What? Oh no! Sorry guys, I'm trying to figure out the loot situation. All those clips look the same, so I can't tell what's what. What? I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! It's stuck! It's letting me run. What the fuck? Nope. 
Where's my pizza at? Yeah, there's my pizza? Oh. How do I eat it? How do I eat it? I don't understand, what's that bar mean? Oh, you have to hold down right click the whole time. Well, I don't have any more grand, so... Yeah, well, I'm fast because I have this. No, this thing. Knee pad speed. Eagle eye glasses. Oh, I can only have a couple of those things. Right shoulder, back armor, right leg armor. Where's your guns at, dude? Mauser, cool. Shit, shit, here we go again. No, no, no. No, I'm gonna die in the energy. Network connection disrupted. Not now. I don't know how to eat this. I would have won that. I had three or four kills. I was fully equipped in armor. The inventory system sucks. It's like I can't tell what's what I can't tell what ammo belongs to what. There's like a billion clips instead of actual ammunition numbers, so And every weapon seems to have its own type of clip. And I you know, disconnected, it wouldn't let me eat I had some food, so I couldn't fix that either. Yeah, it's super rough. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be any option for what? Awesome. Yeah, none of this shit works. I right, cause movie verse, uh, I know everything. That's how I found out. No, so this is the game released Friday. So I think Skill may have been talking about it over the weekend, and then I saw Shroud playing it, so I'm like, I'm gonna have to. And I saw him, I turned on the thing to see what it was, because I saw like a screenshot from, and from afar, it looked like, it looked like PUBG. So maybe someone was making a free version of PUBG in my head, I'm like maybe without the shitty loot boxes, who knows? 
And then uh, I turned it on, and he was wearing those bunny slippers, and, like jumping. And I'm like, holy shit! And wearing like frying pans. And I was like, holy shit! I gotta try this. So I came home. He said I was middle of an article. I'm like, nope. And I came straight home, installed it because it's free to play. Um, if you have Steam Movie First, install it now because it's uh, it released Friday. It's free until the 24th. Then after that, they're gonna start charging. I got dinosaur boxes right now, so. Butt protection. <laughs> the bag you wear like a... Oh. What? Intentionally make the uh... he's waiting for me on the other side of this building. I'm in a rush. Yeah, you just add it to your Steam library. You don't have to actually install it. You must have some sort of computer. You know, like a laptop or something? iron, my knife, and my handbag. He's got a gun though, so I have to be careful. If I were him, I'd for sure be going up to whatever this structure is. Oh, there it is. Yep. See? I'm the predator. Yeah, look at it. Look at my ass. It's waffle iron. I need to fucking so these magazines for shit. I don't. Oh, I got uh, Han Solo's pistol. Ten shots. An axe. Well, I can't use it. Let's go towards the gunfire. No, it's good, man. You're burning uh you're burning calories, so your body needs more. Er oh sick. What's that called? I just want to get into the action. Where are these fools?
It sounds a little weird because you can't hear like basic things nearby, like walking. But if a door moves, it's incredibly loud. Your family grilled out the Father's Day. That's awesome. I w <laughs> My wife made a, a bunch of fresh stuff, but the one thing we didn't have time for is chicken. So I picked up when I was shopping and getting gas for uh, our main vehicle. Um, I picked up rotisserie chicken, but it was raw. raw. It wasn't cooked. Can you believe that? It wasn't fully cooked. So it's Costco fucked us. And it was closed. It would take 20 minutes to drive back anyway. So it's like, what do you do? So I, I had to go buy another rotisserie chicken, which is even more expensive than the local grocery store. It's just so frustrating. So thanks, Costco and Father's Day, for giving us raw chicken. It'll go well with that rotten salad you sold me three weeks ago. Shh, no quality control at that place. Butt ducks protection. Sick upgrade. Mark three. Carnegie Magazine. Oh. 40%. I picked up a drum for this. Oh. Dead bodies everywhere. Where do these guys find all this shit? A bike? I'd rather have the knee pads for sure. I beat bag of regeneration. Look at this fucking back thing I have. Alright. Wait, browning. That's a weapon, isn't it? Shotgun. Can't put a scope on this thing though. Well, that's cool. We'll stick with this PPSH. Pothead Royale. No, nah, that's a negative connotation though. Oh, actually, if you look, look at me moving. You actually see the crazy knee pads of speed. Alright, top 10. If I get disconnected again in this top 10 situation, I'm, I'm turning this game off and I'm going to go back to work. Just so you prepare, movie verse. I know, but pot head is a negative connotation. People won't will avoid that. It is a clever name. They should, what they should do, though, is in-game. Call the game what it is, Cuisine Royale, but your pot head is a mode where you start with a pot in your head. So you start with armor or something, you know what I mean? Or there's like a mega pot, like a big old chef stew pot, and it's like level like four armor or something, you know what I mean? Let's see the next circle is. Oh, perfect. You know what I'm missing? I don't have any head armor. I, I love the little details. The, the animation of climbing over fences. It moves It moves very smoothly. I love the uh, the grass moving when you walk through it. Which 
Look at this shit. I love this kind of thing. We just go fucking ape shit mode. I don't know why my character got up, by the way. Well, I just know marketing. I know headlines, right? It's part of my job, Movieverse. Look, the leaning works really. It's a guy. It's a substantial lean. You know what I mean? And it's responsive. You went to school for marketing? Yee. <laughs> this being free to play though. <laughs> if everyone can run like this. I'm in trouble. Exclusive pastry. Appetizing. I don't know how to eat this shit. Okay, so at least one or two east. He's got a sniper. One thing I wish I could do is look around with my head. With you know, in another game you press Alt to look around. Multiple gunshots. We so still two or three this way. I'm playing the win. Again, I thought I heard something in the bush over there. I do find it interesting that when you're all armored up, you make so much noise when you move. It's a neat, it's a neat way to balance it. Scoped weapons. Uh, all you gotta do is kill. Stay. At, well, there's three enemies left. Let's see what happens here. Am I losing my mind? Or I swear to God, I keep hearing something over here. If you ever play this movie verse, go for this item. I'm hoping this helps me too. This re reload speed is faster. Shot deviation and recoils reduce significantly. So that's epic for shooting, especially when I'm using fast firing uh, submachine guns. And this, the speed and stamina boost. Wait, what does it do? Minus 80% stamina. Oh. So you sacrifice your long sprints for super fast short sprints. Last game, remember we came third, and then the game crashed. I was for sure going to win it. You guys can never seem to find me in the bush.
Ambient sounds are pretty strong too. Nobody comes up from behind. Oh, here we go. He's going this way. There he is. How many times do you think I shot that guy? I for sure started firing first, but I guess he just had a helmet and I didn't. Damn it. Alright, we're gonna get more aggressive this time. We're just going straight. I wanna get kills. I wanna see what the weapons feel like when you're actually fighting up close. We've tried it, we've actually shot people with about six or seven different weapons now, but I haven't used any of the pistols yet. And I haven't hit anybody with a long range sniper shot. So that's what I wanna test. Then I can write a little piece about my impressions of this. Yeah, the hit feedback is very strange, for sure. Like, the red markers are kind of interesting because it lets you know you're hitting with bullets, but you don't feel the actual... I feel like I'm not getting the actual impact feeling, you know what I mean? Because there's no... As far as I can tell, there's no blood effects. You always seem to start... You don't parachute in as well. I don't know if they're going to add that, but we need to be a... Uh, sausage bun? Anything of value in the horse stables? Nope. The, yeah, I wish they fixed the ammo style. You need to get specific magazines for random weapons. So if you don't get that weapon, then what the fuck's the point? Like, and why aren't they putting magazines with weapons? Why would there be a random Luger magazine there? This doesn't make any sense. I guess by doing it this way, they make sure everyone starts off separate, mostly. Huh. The large, <laughs> the large shopping bag, it's awesome. Man, these places are useless. There you go. There we go. So we're already doing better than last time. The armor sitch. Yeah. Got the Luger. What? No Luger? I already have one. Hey, crib. We know all about that, don't we? Move the verse. Uh, there we go. We're talking about. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like the scope. Look how big those lines are. Okay, we got that. Oh, cool. That's cool. See, this game does a lot of things better than PUBG already. Let's just run. We want to fight. I'm going to shopping spree. I mean, killing spree. Yeah. They do that intentionally, I guess. You can find players. They'll tune that down, I'm sure. They got to slightly beef up movement sounds in terms of, like, hearing an enemy player outside of the rattling of their armor. And then we tone down the uh, door opening stuff. Also, you gotta add some uh, features. The only thing you do with this is drag it. There's no, no names or locations. You don't get to choose where you start. There's no. Uh, it'd be, I think paratrooping in would be neat. It's like a trademark of the battle royale genre. Got no stamina.
And these player counts, man. 30 players? No. Make that 100. This map's pretty big. Test the servers out. Oh, I should have picked out the other scope after all. And the draw just looks really nice. I haven't actually seen anybody at range, though, in terms of players to test out any of these ranged guns. The river looks great. There's no splash effects. Love the lighting. Love the environment. Love the building and... and Debris details, like all the shit you see in each little farmstead. Hey, crazy. Uh, I'm going to take a break after this and I got to write some articles and get some articles up for tomorrow. But after that, I might be on. What the fuck is this thing? My... What does this do? What is this thing on my head? Is it though? I don't see it in my inventory. It's already checked. I mean, called Cuisine Royale. It should have been a food fight game. I feel like it's just PUBG with pots and pants for it. No, it's got better environments, better lighting. It's got better leaning. Uh, it's World War II themed. It's got better clothing. Look, I got boxers. It's free to play, and there's no loot boxes, you know? It, it, the shitty parts are the map, which you can't... The, the only interaction you can do is... Whoops. Is this like dragging it around? So fucking. I guess you can zoom in too, but I'm not very special. Doesn't even let you zoom in all the way. It's ridiculous. Um, and you got shopping bags instead of backpacks. Oh, there we go. Thought, I thought I heard something in there, and I thought I saw a player run over here. And all the armor is different pants. And it's got shoulder pads and shit. Look, all these armor slots. Each leg, each shoulder. You can wear a waffle iron as butt armor, Boston. Huh? Think about that. Whoa. Shit! With an AKM. Oh, man. I didn't get to see it. I want to snipe! You 
or not cancel the server. Yeah, right? Also, Boston, the player counts are super low. It's like 30 players, it seems like, when you start. So if they made it 100 players, the map's big enough to support that. The vehicles actually move pretty great, too. Uh, it has, like, a good vaulting. Like, a, you know what I mean? But the sounds are not balanced yet. You just start off in the map randomly with random co random colored boxers. These are sheep, blue sheep boxers. This is pretty good. I have a good feeling about this. I came third, and the game crashed on me, so that was a fail. And then the round after that, I came fourth and died. But the round I, came, I got disconnected when I was in third. I feel like I feel like I was going to win that one. We'll just say I was going to win that one. Yeah, there you go. Look at that. Look at this. Also, Boston, look at this shit. Look, look, look. Can't do that in PUBG. And right from the get-go, you can vault over shit. They got climbing animations. Way more detailed structures and way more varied structures, too. You got Han Solo's pistol? It's super janky. Look at this. Look at this leaning. Woo! You see the spoon hanging off the handle? Can't do that, Bo G. Ooh, I don't like that sound. Also, like, the, the interface is ridiculous. You have to carry like, individual magazines, like every possible gun, I guess. It's hard to tell what's what. Well, this is useless. You see, you need a sniper rifle. How do we get out of this place? Margarine? Astro. Ooh, there we go. Buttocks protection mark one. What is it? What is it? Waffle iron for the ass. There you go, Boston. Head armor. I already got that. Doesn't have the frame rate drops that PUBG does. That's something. Savory ribs, yeah. For sure, I want that. I hear a vehicle. Ooh, this drum magazine, wow. Is there two dudes there? I thought one was going underneath me. That's why I jumped out. All right, one more. I have to kill someone. No, one more kill, at least. Not use a shotgun yet. That's cool. Oh, nice. Did 
That's cool. Yeah, you gotta make squads for this. You have a squad defending this? That'd be sick. Oh, level two head armor. Look at all the spoons in this thing. Woo! Oh, look! What? That's cool. There's like a fridge full of shit. Can I drive this bus? shotgun. Got one. PPSH. What's this? Oh, a double barrel. I'm holding that right click. How do I eat it? If you hold down T, you see the bottom right? It's filling up that med kit symbol. There you go. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure out the controls for that, boss. And that's what I was just doing. No, oh, I'm stuck again. He glitches out sometimes too, like that. Alright. Follow the gunshots. See anybody, Boston? I like that. It's very responsive too, which I like. Look how pretty this is, Boston. How is it so much better looking than PUBG in terms of the environment? It almost doesn't make sense. Even the shield effect is better. Look at this fucking shit hanging out of my back. It's like spoons hanging off the pots. It's awesome. Some trenches.
No. I've used that gun before. I'm using guns I haven't used. We must test. We must test it! someone with this. Irresistible sausages? Yes, please. <gasps> Is that a truck? Oh, guys, we forgot to test the bus. We saw the... I think I hear vehicle in distance this way. Yeah, you hear that? Yeah, it's right here. Recoil. Jesus Christ. Recoil? Nope. How do I fucking throw a grenade? Well, use your name, Movieverse. Like your profile name? Shouldn't it should just make it Movieverse? Use that for everything. Okay. What do you think? One more, guys? Oh. I did heal up, Austin. My health was full. Didn't you see the bottom right? I need to heal up after fighting that guy, yeah. But I, I wanted to, you know, I heard a vo the guy right over the edge, so I wanted to take him out quick. Playing in first, shooting in first person mode, though, is like. With these uh, rapid fire weapons, the auto weapons, no, it's, it's too crazy. Firing from third person seems to be the way to go. If you're just joining the chat, say what up. Movieverse says my internet must be crap right now. Mine, the stream just, is it dead for you guys? Hello. Hang on a second, guys, if you can still see me. Is it working again? It, uh, OBS is taking little dumps on me right now, so maybe my internet's getting... No, I, I think OBS, uh, is dropping frame, is dropping packets. It's, it's, so normally it's green. I'm uploading at 4,500 bits. Uh, but it would drop to, like, yellow and red for a second. Try refreshing now. It, it's working now. Cuisine tactical loot box. Oh my god, I got fucking lucky. Here we go. Real gun. That's the second loot box I found. Nice. Oh, that's a big butt protector, too. What is this? Ho oh. ho. You hear me, but the picture is frozen? Should be, should be working now if you refresh. Man, every round you pick up for the shotgun, 
There's only one. It counts as one shell. Wow. They reload super quick. That's good. Working now? Alright, good. Sorry, guys. If you're in chat, say what up. I got a double butt protector. This is like a pan with a pan hanging off of it. Cool. Actually, when did you become a semi nudist? No, you don't like my dinosaur boxers? Ooh, yeah. Remind me to drive this bus before we leave. M1 carbine. No, I've used an M1 carbine already. We want to use these new guns. We're trying to test shit out. I bet there's more weapons in this game than there are in PUBG. I really want to use the shotgun on somebody, though. Yeah, I use that as well. We're just testing stuff. We're not, we're not playing for the best possible loadout. Mauser. No. No. Oxygen tank of hold breath. Oh, so I have reload speed, shot deviation recoil buff, hold breath, stamina drain. So I guess for sniping, you can hold your breath longer, or maybe you can swim underwater. Yeah, we got, oh, we got a, a waffle iron. Ex Nilio. Oh, so that's a Jonathan Hickman creation, right? Movie verse? In the Avengers? <gasps> ah, no! You think those fridges like parachute in or something? How did he know? Ah, man. They haven't really done anything with those characters lately, though, movie verse. Those traders or the gardeners, whatever they call those guys. I know, I was so excited because I had a whole set of armor plus food. Oh man, I would have been so loaded. Of course the guy just had to be there. There's no sound. Like, we didn't hear that guy at all. Right? Until he fucking shot me. So. Damn it. That's probably the sound. Like, if you open a door, it makes all the sound in the world. But if someone, like, hops over a wall or is, like, walking beside you, you can't hear shit unless they fire a weapon. The one good thing is I'm able to start playing as players were joining the server. I don't know how to use grenades. I don't think I've thrown one yet. Springfield. Yeah, because they're, they're the creators, right? God damn it. Can't use the telescope. Literally unplayable. How do I? Oh, that wouldn't work before. You have to hold it down, I guess. Jesus, what the fuck? It's a full-on IV thing. Regeneration health, and I got speed. All right, sick. Go guys. Three sixty. Zombie says PUBG or R six. No, no. I'm doing some work after this. Sorry guys. 
Got to put some articles up on ScreenRant.com, the best website in the world for film, television, video games, and comic news, interviews, <gasps> truck, features, and other original content. Tomorrow on Screen Rant, big day. If you're a movie fan, you're going to want to check the site tomorrow. We're dropping dozens and dozens of articles and something really cool. Yeah! Can't drive big trucks in PUBG. Press F to use. Hey, get back here. Um, I don't know. It's 1940s, Boston. Can't knock trees over in PUBG. Shit. Why do you care about the Division movie? The Division game has no story whatsoever. Just, just, just lore. You already know the lore. You think these guys can hear me? Alright, we're gonna try something, guys. We're gonna see if we can hit one of these bigger trees. Uh... Hmm. Shit. Hang on. Never give up. I do want to see if I can knock one of these bigger trees over, though. Oh! Look at that shit! Amazing. Also, is that a fridge? Extra, this is World War II era. I already have that. I already have a bag. I already got all this shit. Not good. I need more armor piece. I need a helmet. Damn, what is this? What do you mean? This is the best game ever. <laughs> Try cooking again, it says. Shit! That no, looks amazing, Ham. This came out in early access. It started out as an April Fool's joke on April 1st, but people loved it. So we released it in early access for free on Friday. And if you download it now on Steam, between now and the 25th, you get it for free. For Like, you get the early access version for free. They're going to start charging for the early access version the same way PUBG did, so they can cover the server costs and hosting and shit. Um, and obviously development costs. Uh, it's f absolutely free to play now. But the environments and lighting is so much fucking better, and it runs so much better than PUBG, believe it or not. But it's also lower player counts. I've only seen, I think the highest I've seen is 32 players, maybe? Or 30 players? That seems to be what it is. Oh, is that something? No, never mind. Oh, there we go. This fucking gun. The one that we can't aim. Royal Hunt. Give it to me. We just want to fight, guys. We just want to practice fighting. So let's just go towards the action here. With the PPD-40.
Doesn't even know I'm following him. I guess this gun is meant to be like this, right? With the bipod out on the ground. Hey, event mode ended. Yeah, well, Big Max, right, Megan? Big Max. You should play some other game. Yeah, mounted like these bad boys. I got one of these in my back. So it does run out. Can I fire this thing? Oh, that'd be amazing. Shoot parachuter, parachuters out of this guy. Big Rig's Battle Royale, it's called Twisted Metal. Or Vigilantes 8? Is that, remember that N64 game? That was a fun game. That was the only game I... Well, Twisted Metal 2 was pretty excellent. All the other Twisted Metals I don't really care for. And Vigilante 8 was a lot of fun. But Twisted Metal 2 is something special. That is a game that would do well right now. They said, look... It's all cosmetics. You design your own car, right? That's the cosmetics. Trucks, cars, all these weird fucking vehicle types. And you acquire pieces to make the shape of it and the speed of whatever. Uh, and you get like, gun attachments. and that's all. Just like in Real Twisted Metal, you drive over like the weapons that you fire, right? The heat-seeking missiles, dumb fire rockets, all that kind of shit. 100, 100 fucking custom vehicles drop into an island. Or an airport. Here we go, guys. Shit, I can't see shit. I'm gonna follow this guy. He has to stop at some point. I don't think I like Twisted Metal Black. I don't really remember it, though. Oh, I'm out of stamina. God damn it. If he was driving that truck I was driving earlier, I would have caught up to him. Battle tanks! Oh my god, extra! I played battle. I played the shit four-player local, right? That was in sixty-four too, wasn't it? Was it M sixty-four? There's two of them, and you could choose yellow, red, green, or blue, right? And there's like four or five different types of tanks. That game was incredible. Charge! I have a fucking strainer on my head. It's all good. He's lying down. Do I have any...
How many times did I shoot this guy? Would you like to send a crash report to the developers? Yes. Yes. Fatal error. Yeah, because I'm dead. I have coffee today. Damn, that was just a Friday, Saturday night celebration of E3. So, very early access. The hit, hit detection is ridiculous. The TTK is also really bad, too. I, I, you saw the, there was, how many fucking red X's were there from shooting that dude. Alright, I will stop it there, though. I have to do some work, and I might be on a little later. Uh, I was going to say I was going to put an all-nighter tonight for work, but I, I'm not going to do that. It's bad. It's a bad way to start the week. Even though tomorrow's the busiest day. So, uh, that's, that's your first... Look at Cuisine Royale. If you're interested in checking it out, I recommend doing that. If you have Steam, uh, just go, uh, just search for it in Steam, Cuisine Royale. Um, it came out Friday. It's free. It's free, 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 free to play. But it's only free until the 25th. So download it now. Or just, don't even have to download it. Just add it to your library. Then you get it before they start charging for it. Um, so hopefully this gets some substantial updates very quickly. Otherwise, people are going to drop off of it and not want to return because... First impressions count. So they gotta fix some shit. Yeah. Anyways, you can't add it to your library? Alright, just hit play now and then download it or whatever, I guess. Yeah, I guess you do the download it, right, Ham? I don't know, that's weird. Whatever. Download it if you can. It's free. Who knows what they're gonna charge for it on the 25th. Might be ten bucks, could be thirty bucks, like like PUBG. But, uh, but my first thing I think they need to do is fucking fix the recoil on some of these guns. Uh, fix level the set, reduce door sound, increase movement sound, so you can hear people doing stuff. Uh, and then this player count needs to be a hundred, and let people choose where they spawn. If you're not choosing where you spawn, you gotta let people parachute in. And fucking we need squad play. It's only single player right now. You just qu quick match, so. Uh, Ham says you pre-ordered Mario Tennis Aces, which comes out. Does that come out the twenty sixth? Does that come out this week? Isn't it, or is it? Isn't it this week? I don't know. And Ham, that's not accurate. And you're being mean. All of me is average at games. You're ju you're just you know, below that when it comes to Rainbow Six, I guess. I don't know. Um, comes out Friday. There you go. Okay, so we'll be reviewing that. I think uh, Derek Stoffer is reviewing Lego The Incredibles from PS4 right now for Screen Rant. And um, Rob Gordon is reviewing Cultist Simulator, which came out like a week or two ago. And I'm going to do like impressions pieces for this, Sky Noon, Wreckfest, uh, and someone else is reviewing it. We have a couple Switch games we're, we're reviewing right now as well. So... Uh, lots of uh, little game reviews and impression pieces coming out uh, on Screen Man, as well as uh, what we, uh, we were doing a bunch of what we learned sort of articles on, on uh, all the appointments and interviews we did at E3. So we put up a bunch over the last three or four days. There'll be a bunch more that Mansoor is putting up. So lots of big gaming content and movie content, of course, coming to ScreenRant.com this week, so check it out. Oh, you spent 20 hours into it. Oh, wow. So it, it did come out like two weeks ago, right, Ham? Oh, interesting. Yeah. Uh, there's a few other games I want to try. I want to try that Battletech game. I still haven't played that yet, and I'm, I was a big Tech Warrior fan. So I may do that, and if if I am able to put some hours into that, maybe I'll write an article about that for Screaming as well. But I'm having so much trouble finding time to write during the day now. So, uh, Anyways, I might be on later. If not, I will see you hopefully tomorrow. So, But I plan to be on later on tonight after I get some work done. So cheers.